Sometimes you gotta do that. I was f***ed up. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the studio. You're joining me for another reaction and commentary video here. Um, he's back. PDD's back, AKA the diddler. He's back online doing some shady sh stuff, <laughs> as we can expect, right? So recent video, I just wanted to do a recap on the video that we did about Diddy and beating Cassie um, a couple years back and how that video came out and leaked. Now, Diddy came out with his response on his Instagram um, page uh, saying, pretty much trying to apologize um, for all his indiscretions that he's done and trying to paint himself as this um, reform um, God among men, all right? So we're gonna watch this video. I mean, you guys let me know in the comment section if you guys like his apology or what you um, consider that to be um, something that we should take in to let them off the hook for an apology, all right? So you guys let me know, but let's watch this video and I'll tell you, we'll discuss it more afterwards. Let's go. It's so difficult to reflect on the darkest times in your life. Sometimes you gotta do that. I was f***ed up. I mean, I hit rock bottom, but I make no excuses. My behavior on that video is inexcusable. I take full responsibility for my actions in that video. I'm disgusted. I was disgusted then when I did it, I'm disgusted now. I went and I sought out professional help. I had to go into therapy, and go into rehab. I had to ask God for his mercy and grace. so sorry but I'm committed to be a better man each and every day I'm not asking for forgiveness I'm truly sorry all right guys welcome back I gotta tell you I was a little bit sad to watch a little bit sad just a little bit that man's not fooling nobody. That shit was terrible. If I ever seen a bad apology in my entire life, like there was no remorse, right? All right. All I saw was you sitting there not taking accountability for your actions, bro. The apology was half cocked. There's nothing to it. It took no initiative, no accountability for anything that you did in that video. You're, you're out here talking about. Oh, you were fucked up. We all been fucked up, right? And the only reason you're out here on video talking um, nonsense about I'm a reformed man and I'm I'm with God and I'm seeing a higher power and all that stuff, right? The only reason you're sitting there doing this right now is because of the fact that it is on camera. You got caught. It's on camera. And now you're trying to say that, you know, you're disgusted of yourself. Why weren't you disgusted of yourself when it first came out and you pretty much said um, they were trying to take advantage of you, take all your money, take your money, get money out of you and stuff like that? Huh? Why didn't you apologize then? Why is, you wait till after you got caught to be like, I'm sorry, I'm deeply um, disturbed of what, what I have did. I'm seeking God. I'm seeking therapy and higher power. Take some accountability for your actions, bro. Right, I, I have no love for for dudes that just sit there and beat up on defenseless women. Right, I wish you Cassie was a bodybuilder and she would have whooped your ass in that hallway. That I would love to see. That shit would have been amazing to see. That would be the funniest shit to see. Right. That being said, though, right, I don't understand how these um like um I'm quoting Cat Williams, all these big dick deviants out here. Right, sitting all the on these massive amount of money, right, throwing their wealth and their influence around, and then 
they think they can come on a camera and do one little small apology and think that's going to cover for all the hurt they've caused over the years to all the people's life they've destroyed over the years. And you think you're just going to come sit on camera and be like, I'm sorry, I'm deeply hurt, I apologize, I'm working on myself. Fuck that. Take some accountability. You really want to apologize? Stop hiding. Come back to the media that you love so much. I can't, like Take responsibility for all the stuff you've done over the years, all the allegations, address those, show the public who you truly are, right? Do that, T do some time. Right? Until you do some time, I don't even want to, nobody wants to have a conversation with you, bro. Do some time, take some accountability for your actions, and then maybe we can start a discussion and start the healing of all the people you've hurt over the years. Right? Set the record straight. Let's see, let's see all your receipts. You know, you said you haven't done most of these things. Clearly, the Cassie one came out that you tried to cover for all these years, right? And I was thinking that that one incident where they said you shot that woman in the face in the club, man, take some action, take some responsibility for your actions. That's my opinion anyways, right? I don't know how you guys feel about it. Like I used to love Diddy's music over the years. Like some of his stuff was fire, but man, this is crazy. But that being said, I digress. Take some responsibility for your actions. Do some time. Maybe we can have a discussion after that. But until then, stay off of social media. No, but that. Come back on social media. Take responsibility so the world can know what kind of person you truly are. Right? But I'm done. I can't even do I can't even follow this shit no more. Anyways, you guys let me know what you think in the comments. It was this a great um was this a, a good apology? Do you guys take this? Or are you guys just saying, nah, go to jail, son? But let me know. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.